What's up guys? Welcome to another episode of Speed Sim. Uh, it's just me today. Uh, I don't trust Eric with this video because of his high cap of the last time I seen it. So without further ado, today we're going to be going over how to clean your high cap. But many of you guys have requested how to clean your gas blowback pistol, but since most of you guys who watch our content mostly are talking about the high cappas, so that's what I'm going to be focusing on, but it applies to all uh, pistols out there on the market. Alright, so what you're going to need is you're going to need a tissue paper or um, t uh, paper towel, Q-tips, and oil. You can use murder oil or uh, silicone. I would recommend going with murder oil, but if you only have silicone in your arsenal, then that's fine as well. So first start by stripping the high kappa or whatever gas pullback pistol you have. And in high kappas, you hit that second notch, push out the pin, and it comes apart. So right now we're going to focus on just the frame itself. Pretty self-explanatory. Um, you're going to take your paper towel so, like so, and what I like to do is I like to run across the top of the frame like so, where the hammer and everything meets up right there on the top. You can just clean this off. Same thing with the all the rails, all the insides, inside where the uh, grip gets screwed down onto. And then from there, what I like to do is I like to take a Q-tip and on the inside of the rails I'd like to take that and just kind of clean it off. So all the rails get all nice and cleaned up. Uh, this is just what I like to do. You don't necessarily have to do this but it is a good idea just because you can get all the dirt and grime outside of the rails where your slide sits on. So just do that and you're gonna be right as rain. So next up I'm gonna focus on the slide. Slide is super super simple. Uh, you don't have to clean anything. Um, you can, I guess, if you really want to be a little thorough, you can take this completely down and pull it apart. And you can loop up your guide rod and the guide plug. You can do that. Uh, you don't necessarily have to. I do that when I clean my stuff uh, just because I like to be a little bit more thorough than that. Um, if you have, this is just a plastic uh, high cap of barrel. Um, but if you have one of the metal ones like UAC or anything else like that, it's a good idea to hit it with some lube right on the top of the uh, barrel nut up here. Just a couple drops. Kind of rub it on there. So it slides smoother on your slide. If you're using one of the metal slides, if you just have a plastic slide, uh, you don't necessarily have to do that. But if you got the metal ones on metal, then that's probably a very good idea that you should do that. Moving along the slide, again, like what I like to do, is I like to take the Q-tips on the inside where, it, where the rails of the slide meet the rail of the frame. I like to take the Q-tip and just run it along to clean it up because you can see how dirty that guy is. And do the same thing on the opposite side. Clean it all nice and deep and you're going to be right as rain. And then from there, it's really s simple to so pull back on your loading nozzle here. You can expose your uh, blowback unit and then with your oil, whatever you have, put two drops on the O-ring on the inside, let it go, and just kind of work that in there like so. And then once you're done with that, you just put everything back together. Barrel in, guide plug and guide rod in. And then you're set for that. Now, with the frame, when you lube it up, uh, you can do it a couple different ways. I like to do the uh, Q-tip where I put a couple drops of uh, silicone oil on the Q-tip itself. And then I can just run along on the inside on the tops here. All the tops get lubed up. And on the inside of all the rails like we've already cleaned up before. And that about does it. And you just put all your, your stuff back together, slide on your frame, slide locking pin, and that's it. Pretty much ready to go to play. Now, if you're using HPA, like we've mentioned, you need to lube up once before you go out and play, and the day when you come back, or you can do the night of or the, night, uh, the day after, it doesn't matter, as long as you do it twice because you are using HPA, which again, is a dry gas. If you're using green gas, you don't have to do it necessarily that much. Uh, uh, it is a good idea, but you don't have to. Just do it once over, and then you're gonna be right as rain. All right, guys, this completes your guide for how to clean your high capo or any gas blowback pistol you have out there. And uh, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.